He might have a rockstar attitude, but this guy still knows how to ride snowboard halfpipes. Sean White won the Superpipe final at the Dutor Breckenridge, but let's see the other winning runs first. Idaho girl Kathleen Farrington kicked ass at the women's Superpipe and won with this run. And if you wonder, Kelly Clark became fifth. She wants to be gone, she wants to be strong She's been lonely for too long Call her free, call her geek She's no ordinary girl Don't you worry, I really like you I know that it's coming through Someday I will be with you Come over, come over I'll bring you over Mark McMorris owned the big air showing clearly that the mediocre result at the Ehrenstein in Beijing two weeks ago was just an accident. Every time that I pass her by, she tries to catch a glimpse of me. We should notice that I'm much like her. Same day, same for you. And Mark also dominated the Slopestyle Finals, leaving Chaz Goldemann with almost 5 points behind. So good to know the chemistry this girl and me you're just telling me you have never won a slope style competition and you know everyone was dealing with at the due tour everyone was dealing with the conditions today but for some reason it seemed not to affect you why yeah I had really awesome people working on my board make sure it's fast and um, yeah everything just went my way I guess I Kept it smooth and was able to get to the bottom of the course alive. <laughs> but how nervous were you knowing that Torstein still had that final run? Yeah, I'm, Torstein is insane at snowboarding. Like you guys saw, he had it, right, the best so run we saw all day going until next. the third jump. But um, sure you hey, you never know what he's going to pull off. He's a, a really talented snowboarder. But yeah, I was nervous, but it all worked out. So. I think the uh, talented snowboarder part can be said the same for you. Hope you have room in that luggage for your two Ducups. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Guys. And there was the super pipe and the dominance of an Olympic gold medalist and big air appenin. Yes, Sean White still needs a haircut and his choice of pants is still arguable, but at least he showed some humanness sitting down after a double rodeo. Rotation, I guess, and it just I was just off access. It wasn't the right thing, but um, I'm pretty happy I put that first run down. I think that was my best turn today for sure. And if you look back at Torino, the double cork was the trick that you needed to have. Now today, it's a trick that you have back to back in your run. 
What do you expect to be the next evolution of the pipe? Um, I don't know, it's crazy. I mean, I, I, I created that trick at the last Olympics, so 2010, and uh, there's still maybe two guys that can do it, myself and iPod, maybe one more, but um, I don't know, it's such a powerful trick. I'm glad I have it in the arsenal there. And I, got, I, got, I, got, I got some more things in store, so we'll, we'll see you next event. All right, well, congratulations to you. Thank you. Want more Big Air? Click here to see Shroud 196 with the Air in Style Beijing and some gnarly 1440 triple corks. In case you rather like powder, click here for Nicolas Müller and Danny Kass riding some Europe Pow Pow. It's your choice. My name is Meezy. See you soon.